1994, the Association for Computing Machinery awarded two men the highly coveted Turing Award for pioneering the design and construction of large-scale artificial systems. These are their stories. Dr. Reddy was born in 1937 in southeast India. As a child, Raj was interested in airplanes and engineering and was a member of the Indian Air Force ROTC. He earned his bachelor's in civil engineering in India and then traveled to Australia to pursue a master's in technology. In 1964, Raj began working towards a PhD at Stanford under the guidance of another legendary Turing Award winner, John McCarthy. For a class project, Raj decided to make use of an analog to digital converter hooked into a PDP-1 and look into speech signals. Having traveled across the globe for school, Raj had picked up multiple languages. Thus, the analysis of speech and language caught his interest over more popular topics of the era, like timesharing. Over the next few decades, Raj's class project expanded first into his PhD thesis and then into a lifelong research topic that has become the foundation for modern speech recognition algorithms. In 1969, Raj decided to follow in the footsteps of AI legends Newell and Simon and joined Carnegie Mellon as an associate professor. By 1992, he was the dean of the School of Computer Science, had founded the Robotics Institute, and had attracted a wealth of talent and government funding to the Computer Science Department. Today, Raj is still working on speech recognition in addition to a multitude of other AI and knowledge understanding research projects. He has received national honors from France and India for his work and promotion of computing in developing nations, as well as a number of other awards from various computing organizations. Dr. Feigenbaum was born a year before Raj in 1936 in New Jersey. The son of an accountant who taught him how to use a calculator early on, Feigenbaum took to math and science and eventually received a scholarship to study electrical engineering at Carnegie Mellon. He was first exposed to computers in a course taught by Herb Simon in which he learned to program an IBM 701. Feigenbaum stayed at CMU to do a PhD dissertation on representing human memory on a computer. Sometime after this, Feigenbaum accepted a position at Stanford and began research on what would become the study of expert systems. At the time, most AI research focused on how to get computers to make better inferences, but Feigenbaum took a different approach. He suspected it would be better to build an expansive knowledge base around a particular subject from which the computer could learn and apply a set of rules to tackle a problem. This idea led to his creation of the first expert system, which helped organic chemists identify unknown organic molecules. Through his research, Feigenbaum showed the world that an AI's knowledge base is just as crucial as its methods of reasoning. <laughs>